Right. So, but just, do, do, do they think, do these people think that Tom Coburn is a rhino? Do they think that George some, do some they may think do. That George Will is a rhino? Do they think Ron Johnson is a rhino? Some may do. Do they they're... think Scott Walker, who disagrees with this strategy, is a rhino? Some may do. Do they if think they that are... Charles Kraut Hammer is a rhino? Yes. Do they think that uh, Well who are these Paul, people? Paul, Paul just, Ryan. Just, let me, just, let me just, just explain just... to you. Let me just explain to you but, and to anybody who's listening. All right. If these people if Charles Krauthammer is not a true Republican, and if Paul Ryan's not a true Republican, and if Tom Coburn's not a true Republican, and if Scott Walker's not a true Republican, I've got bad news for them. They're in the wrong party. They're actually the ones who are not Republicans. They are. That's, they are, that's all well and good, Joe. And that's. And that, is that, it true? That, uh, would you agree it's true? I would agree it's true. But I'm just what I'm saying to you. What I'm trying to get you to understand is what, what are, are you what, trying what, to get <laughs> you to understand? <laughs> what, are the, Please, what are the motivations here? If you could talk here? slowly for look, me, I, that I, would I, help. You went to Alabama. No, I'm not trying to. I'm not, I'm not trying to talk down to you. I'm just trying to say, look. <laughs> You're not trying to. You just are. No. <laughs> well, you, you, need, you need to get in where people are. I mean, you, you, you're sort of looking at this from yeah. up here. You have yeah, a that, lot of. You, have a you lot know, of, that's my problem. That's what he I, 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 look, you, I look from trying, up here. I'm I don't. Just trying, I'm just you know what? I, you. I need to be in the streets with the people yeah, like yeah, you. Yeah, maybe you need to be yeah. there a little bit more to understand exactly yeah. what's motivating okay, uh, so someone tell like us, a tell us. Just, uh, If you let me get there, I will. <laughs> what's motivating a lot of these people goes back to goes back to big government Republican spending in the in the Bush era. Oh. That leads all the way. Uh, well, up I, to don't, now. I don't know anything about that. I, know, I, I it's only not wrote a question, couple of books know, on that. Don't know. I'm just, I'm well, don't help. lecture I'm just, me I'm about not, what I know. Joe, I'm not trying to lecture you. I'm trying to get you to, under, to put in the context. Of <laughs> Why someone like a Ted Cruz has the momentum he has across the country, and he's not concerned about what all those names you just listed think of him. His audience is not Washington. His audience is much bigger than Washington. And he's trying to tap into a sentiment that exists at the grassroots level. Yes, some of it's Tea Party, but some of it isn't. He's trying to coalesce around, get people coalesced around a certain idea or and, ideology. And, and what's, what's that idea? What is it? Less government spending. I've heard that. A, a lot of the things that we talked about. Why, why do we have to go out here and talk about spending more money before we deal with deal yeah, with the real, the root causes of the, of the problem and, 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 look, and so he's trying to call the attention there and lies the problem I mean, the, I don't agree with the strategy. The I'm just trying to say, this but don't, is what's don't going lecture on. me about. I, I'm not lecturing. I've been talking about this for 12 years. I criticized George W. Bush well before you, and well before 99% of conservatives criticized George W. Bush. I criticized George W. Bush then for you blowing a hole in the national deficit, then. while Ted Cruz was working for George W. Bush. Then you should understand Setting what this Setting his alarm is. at 3 a.m. in the morning, and then sending an email, and then going back to sleep, so everybody on the Bush campaign <laughs> thought he was staying up all night. <laughs> and talk to anybody who worked in Bush's 2004 campaign, and they will tell you that's what Teddy Cruz did. So, listen, that's the insanity of the entire Ted Cruz experience this week. He's lecturing people who agree with him. Yeah. The only thing yeah. he's doing is he's enacting a stupid tactic that is, as the Wall Street Journal said, like running into bayonets. And I don't, be, I don't need to be lectured by the guy that just ordered Pickett's charge to turn around and say, hey, listen, I'll tell you what we're going to do. Because I was part of Pickett's charge in 1995 to 1996, and we ran up that hill, and Bill Clinton slaughtered us in the shutdown, and all we did was reelecting. There are some people that have been here longer than a couple of minutes that actually know that there's a better way to build a car. There's a better way to beat a liberal president. But, 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 but Ted Cruz would look at the numbers that you started the show with and say, that's the energy I'm going after. That's why I'm the doing The problem I'm doing. is, but I'm just, I'm and Republicans know this, Ted Cruz is trying to take that advantage away from us. And what we said at the right. beginning of this, we conservatives said at the beginning of this, Things are actually breaking our way for the first time in a couple of years. Our numbers are better for the first time than they've been since like 2011. Barack Obama's numbers are weaker than they've been. Let's not do what we usually do and get in our way. All right? Let's figure out a smarter strategy. But I thank you for telling me what small government conservatives. Oh, stop. Stop it. I understand.